They say the best comes once in a lifetime and never the like has been seen again. Something amazing happened at Gomahia and we all witnessed it. He came, conquered and made a name. A name that will be echoed for many years to come. A name that is worth placing on a Christmas tree to be remembered year in year out within Kenyan local league. His performance, dedication and discipline placed him above many local players and those are exactly what he needed to be the man he was. Jacques Tuisenge. He was not a politician or a rare billionaire from Silicon Valley to be that famous, but the three and a half years that Rwandis lived in Kenya were enough to make him a household name on Mata's football. A career well wedded through, a career full of glitz and glamour that every footballer would wish to have. Three league titles, two Sportpesa Super Cup medals, a charity cap medal and scintillating performance in continental football are all under his name. Chiyosenge, Chiyosenge, back to Chiyosenge, can he finish it now? He can! Jacques Chiyosenge with the header. And these happened in just three and a half years while at Gold Mahia. They say a striker's work is to score goals and Tuisenge perfectly did that for the club. A massive 63 goals in all competitions in just three and a half years. And for those who thought the club wasted 4 million shillings on signing him in 2016, a calculation of what he helped the club to achieve will surprise many. Signed at 4 million, helped the club to win three league titles, which translates to 13.5 million shillings. His 10 goals in CAF competitions helped the club to win a total of 62 million in just two years. We can't forget his goal that sent the club to CAF quarters after many decades in darkness. In all competitions, he helped Go Mahia win about 81 million in just three and a half years. And if his contributions in helping the club to win over 80 million were not enough, then his goal against Everton was worth more than the 4 million he was signed for. A goal that was a perfect answer to Wayne Rooney's first goal on African soil. A goal that will forever remain in history books as Go Mahia's first goal to be scored against Everton on African soil. My brother, are you okay? He's a true professional. His, his attitude, his work ethic, his desire, his passion, his energy. What made to Senge be a good striker, it was his speed and technical ability. He can pass the ball, he can score, he can help the team, and he's a fighter, a real fighter. Now, as I know, Jack Tuisenge has been so productive and he's been helpful to uh, our club, Gormania. When he scored, he celebrated. His teammates celebrated his goals, and we all celebrated. History will tell a tale of one of the strikers without an equal. Even the generation that knows no success and believed it would never end, could never end, witnessed his end at Go Mahia. We enjoyed his moments at Go Mahia and we truly appreciate his work while in green and white colors. We wish him all the best in his endeavors.